Okay, so that's kind of interesting. Um, just because it's a semi-tethered jailbreak, it will boot up, but you won't have, as I said there, full functionality. Um, okay, so that's why it may not have, you know, why it you know, didn't work. Uh, now, let's go ahead and turn it off again. I, I, I think it's only just because my button up there is messed up. I don't feel when I have it, like, pushed down. It's like because you know normally entering DFU mode that's not hard but you know when you have a messed up button it is hard <laughs> Okay, now let's go ahead and do this. Ten seconds. I don't get why is it getting like turned off. I don't get that. Why is it? If it's not pl not off, plug the device to your computer off, then holding down the power button on the edge until sliding the power off. Click next only when your device is booted off and plugged in. Let's try these instructions. Hmm, that's very interesting. You have ended up in recovery mode instead of DFU mode. You probably misunderstood the instructions. Oh my god. But I mean, it's only it's because I have a messed up little button up here. It's really like messed up. I hate that shit. Like, why? Okay. Hold on the power. Okay. Let's go ahead and try this again. Hold in 10 seconds. But I mean, I suppose it should be, you know, turned off, but... One, two, three... And then it gets... I don't know what's that it, what, you know, what, what it's doing, but... Okay, let's try let's try to do it when we see the Apple logo again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I don't know why. I think it's just because this one has a shitty button up there in the top. Let's just try when it gets flashed and the screen turns off. Let's try to release the. Oh, now it's working. Okay, so now I get it. Uh, when the screen uh, flash, then you should release the power button up there in the top. But I mean, that's kind of weird because, you know, usually I've been doing that for 10 seconds. This time it was only for like a couple of seconds. Okay, so that's weird. But you know, after flash, you, it's like almost instant. You can go ahead and release the home, the power button, but still release the home button. And then you went to the view mode. Okay, so that's interesting. I, I've never had that before. Usually it's been like you hold them down for like 10 seconds or 7 seconds and then that flash occur and then you just hold it on for like a couple of more seconds and then you release it this time 
it was something else, okay? That's weird. Uh, the reason why I'm not going to cut this video though is so you can see that, you know, it's the real deal. Uh, the rest of the process takes place on your device. Okay, so that's awesome. Um, now we can just go ahead and go back. Now we should be able to see uh, the city of thingies uh, when it gets booted up. I'm not sure how this recording is doing, but hopefully it's doing well. Um, okay, so it's on right now. Let's go ahead and see. There we go! We have Cydia! Um, so yeah, guys, that's just a very, very uh, brief tutorial or long tutorial on how you can go ahead and do this. Now, the reason why it did take such a long time for me now was just because uh, I didn't know this new thing that you, you know, usually the DFU mode has always been that you hold it down for 10 seconds. This time it was only for like a couple of seconds and then the flash occurred and then you had to release the... Um, the power button up there in the top. Okay, so that's weird, but at least we have it jailbroken right now. I was 5.0.1 on my iPod Touch 3rd generation. Um, so that's awesome. See you guys.